What's up guys? Um, I did, like I said, I was gonna take out the driftwood from this tank and my god, there's so much new, I mean there's so much more space in this tank. So now you can see a bunch of, you know, fish moving around and now this tank looks a little bit more empty. So you know what that means, that means I'm gonna add more fish. Yep, I'm going to add more fish to this tank because, like, you know, there's a lot more space left. I mean, it kind of looks a little crowded, just a little bit, but, like, come on. I'm still going to add some more fish. Um, I tried, again, to put um, the Aquadins Diademics or, like, Diadema or, like, Pandex Chiclet. I, I mean, Cichlid, sorry. But I tried to put him in. Um, looks like it's working. He's starting to warm up to this tank. He's gotten a little beaten up. That's okay. I also added the Kenny. Kenny. I don't know how you say it, but I added him. He's doing well. I added, you know, these little guys from the grow a tank and him. Because this guy was a lot like the Scoliophi here. He was a little bit aggressive for um, the fish in the tank. So he was chasing everybody and so is this guy. And I was gonna add um, another one of uh, the smaller fish, like there's another one of these um, fish right here. But you know what, I, I'd like to keep it. Like I don't wanna keep two of the same type of fish in this tank. So I'm, I was gonna add the, also, um, the whitetail ACI that I have but um, he was just way too hard to catch so maybe later um, I can try using this to catch him though I set that up I mean I just took it out and I'll try again um, the heater is just like off the off the wall because these fish keep on like you know, running into it and then it just pops off because like the suction cups aren't that long. But another problem that I'm facing now is that this filter is so strong and it's pushing all the gravel away from this tank. So I think I'm just gonna put like the driftwood on top of it and maybe that could be like a little cave. And with that also, this filter is like whenever the water level drops like below an inch or something it just like like it starts like you know spraying water out which is a little bit of a problem that I'm trying to solve so yeah that, those are the problems as of now and I know I said I wouldn't add any more abuna but you know I just want to grow these guys out I know these guys like will grow much faster in a 125 than a 75 and since they're much aggressive I mean much more aggressive like in that tank I think they'll do fine here. So, and when they grow out, I'll sell them, you know, the usual. But, uh, I'm going to be selling, like, some of my bigger Ambuna. So, like, you know, maybe this guy or, like, uh, where is the other guy? You already know the horror and stuff. Keep on talking about that. Like, the Bumblebee, when they get to that size... Um, that's usually when I'd like to like sell my Ambuna. I don't really sell them big size because you know that raises a red flag if they're big, and that means they're super aggressive to people. So I think I'd sell them at that size. You know, so that's a good size. 